dear teachers, the modules that the Ministry of Education provide us are a great tool which support our teaching practice. Here we have some recommendations you can apply to take advantage of them. This time, we are going to give you some practical tips to develop reading with the students of first of bachillerato. Remember that we have to prepare our students to have a great time with reading if we want to take succeed in this skill, develop their critical thinking, increase their cultural knowledge and vocabulary, and improve their intellectual and scientific curiosity. First, let's remember the three stages or moments when we do reading. Pre-reading. On this first stage, we teachers generate the learner's interest in the topic, making use of clues and illustrations, such as the titles or headlines and the pictures. Learners can predict what the text will say, and we can encourage them to discuss about the topic. We can also present essential vocabulary for the reading tasks. A second stage, reading. Here, set the task and a time limit. After, students read the text individually, in the small groups or in the big groups. It facilitates the student's reading comprehension. And finally, students do the task in order to prove if they understood the reading. Post reading. After doing the task, students will compare their answers in pairs or small groups. They can also check the answers as a class. Finally, they can express their personal reactions to the text, giving opinions or comments based in the article. We find all these moments in these articles from the module with the different activities and tasks, which will involve readers in the magic of reading. On page number four of the first module, we will read about the origin and evolution of life. We can start encouraging our students to do a brainstorm about the title giving them the opportunity to say uh, some previous ideas about the topic. After that, it's very useful to teach essential vocabulary for the reading task. It will, will help students to understand the reading faster and better. Then students will read the text. After reading, they will develop the tasks in a classwork where they will have the opportunity to compare their answers. They will also receive feedback from the teacher. And finally, we can also encourage them to reflect about the information in the text. We can do other type of activities like draw a timeline related to the eras because that is the topic of this reading. On page 10, 
we will find information about mass extinction. Here, students have the opportunity to discuss what do they think about the picture. Here, they can give some uh, specific vocabulary related to the picture. They can uh, look the image and describe what they understood about that as manner of brainstorm. After that, the students scan the text to get new words. It facilitates the reading comprehension. Then, students read the text. It could be individually, in pairs, or as group. Uh, after students share or compare their uh, comprehension. Finally, they develop the task. Page number 26, we have another interesting reading and it is also going to help us to teach grammar in an implicit way. First, we can encourage our students to discuss about the question we have at the first part of the page. Then, as we have mentioned, it's very helpful to check vocabulary. These are words that the students will find in the reading. So it would help them to understand the article better. After that, the students will read and identify and underline the causes in all sentences because the target grammar structure design is zero and first conditionals. The students will check the grammar note and identify if the sentences in the reading are zero or first conditional. Finally, they will develop the task. It will give them the opportunity to apply what they understood about the article and also the grammar patterns they have learned about the conditionals. I am Ana Lucia. And I am Maria de Lourdes. We hope you find this presentation useful for your teaching practice. Thank you very Thank much. You.